Hey guys, Danish Kasumali here, back for another video. And today, I'm gonna show you guys the all new Silky Sublimation Boxers and Underwear. Yup, I went through a lot of development, energy, and time to get this right. So I wanna give you that story, tell you what that journey was like, and go through some of our blank and printed styles. Are you ready? Let's do it. All right guys, so it all started in 2019 in my visit to China. Some of you guys have seen a video where I visited my factory. It's like a behind the scenes look where I toured the factory. There at that visit, I was trying to develop some boxers. Okay, yeah, so like our arm sleeve material, this kind of compression material is what we need for the compression underwear. So I need it like this material, but in white, um, so we can sublimate print on it. So can we make a sample of uh, this kind of underwear, but this material? Yeah, that's what I'll need, and then I'll test print it. And I think m this part can be black, probably. This part black, and the rest plain white. We, probably, we don't need this pattern either. All, all white, yeah. the elastic in black, and then uh, this material so we can sublimate it. So I'll call it like a compression underwear. That makes sense? You think we can do it? Okay. And we tried a few styles out. Uh, this was the first style we had come up with. Um, it has a black top and uh, white. Uh, the rest of the part is white, so you can sublimate all of the white area. But after making a few samples, I discovered a lot of flaws. A lot of flaws up here. It just wasn't getting nice and flat. The crotch area had a lot of flaws as well. And the crotch itself, construction and makeup of it, just the overall style, it just was not very desirable. Here's another example. A um, lot of imperfections and not much of a crotch area here for men. And I just, I just wasn't really feeling it. So then I went back to the drawing board I tried to rework it where we added a black layer here underneath the waistband to see if that would improve the printability right here. And we all also made the crotch black so you'd be able to print on all the white areas. And I took a look at this thing and I was like, uh, nah, that doesn't really look that cool, man. So then I scrapped that. Then I kind of shelved the idea. I was like, nah, maybe boxers is not meant to be, you know? So I shelved the idea. We came out with new socks, uh, 2020 came along, we had headbands, face masks, neck gaiters, all sorts of cool items going on since then. Then in our Facebook group, Sublimation with Silky Socks, which if you're not in it, please do join. I started seeing some comments uh, when I, sh I shared a little a live video about some of these styles and I started seeing some comments uh, when I talking about boxers and like, oh my God, I need those. Um, I really want those. And people were just super excited. So then I thought, hmm, let me see if I could rework these somehow. And I, you know, I had some of these samples still saved from the year before. So I just started examining them and I started going to retail stores. Like I went to Calvin Klein's, Tilly's, uh, Zoomies, just to name a few, and buying up underwear, buying up some different premium underwear brands that, that you see out there in the market, and uh, just feeling them, testing them, wearing them, seeing what they're like, and then um, talk to my factory to rework it. So, what we did is we swapped out the waistband to white, so you can sublimate the whole waistband, and tried to make this part as flat and smooth as possible, so it's easy to sub right there. And then also we reshaped the crotch. We extended it a bit from the previous one so it actually has room for the crotch. And we shaped it nice and flat so it flattens out during sublimation, right? And my uh, favorite feature, um, I had them add a cotton interior layer. So this is an organic cotton interior just on the inside right here for comfort. And the rest of the boxer is polyester and spandex blend, premium. The material is stretchy, soft, comfy, 
and it sublimates amazing. Let me show you. So this is the blank before, all right? Here are a couple afters, check this one out. YouTube is life, of course. I had to make this one for myself because the YouTube channel has just been awesome. 20,000 subscribers now. Thank you guys for subscribing to the channel. You guys are awesome. And the journey's just been real. But look at the sublimation on this thing. Just fully subbed, stretchy. Um, even under here, the waistband, the, the little bit of slight imperfections, but nothing crazy. Just very nice, right? And even the crotch area flattens up so nicely. And this is black sublimation, guys. So this started off as an all white boxer and I put an all over sublimation on it. Uh, even the crotch area, nice and smooth. So you can sub the whole thing. YouTube is live. Let's see another one. This one has a little bit more neutral color, not black, so you could even see it even better. You can see the Meaning like you, the imperfections won't even stand out as much. So it just looks pretty much picture perfect. Now the press size you would need, um, in the description you'll find all the, the sizes of each size so you can look to see what press size you have to see if you could fully sublimate this thing in one press. If you have a 16 by 24 heat press size, you could fully sublimate up to our 2X in just one press. So that is the desirable size to get if you uh, really want to get get become a pro at these. 16 by 20 will work, but you might have to do two, two presses and sections. So look at that, beautiful. Just a full photo on the undies. Can you believe it? And all these printed samples I'm showing you literally have gone through the laundry already two, three, four times. These are my personal samples. Don't worry, they're clean, but these are the men's large. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys some printed samples that uh, I've already had washed and worn and tested. I know that's kind of gross, but hey, uh, they're clean now and uh, just giving you the realness. This one says stocks rising. Yes, sir, stocks are up, let's get it. So again, a full black sub. Again, this started off as white, guys. And the material on this, uh, it's honestly, it just feels so silky, so smooth, dry and comfy, right? All right, so that's the men's. You're probably wondering, what about kids? What about ladies? Never fear. So one of my samples that I was shopping for, this is not the silky sublimated one, but I did accommodate for youth. Um, this was one of the samples I was checking out in my shopping process. You know, just a nice premium quality boxer. Um, and we do have youth medium and large available. So youth small is gonna be the next size that, uh, that I wanna develop for the product line. And ladies, let's see what I got for the ladies. Yep, ladies bikini style underwear available in from extra small to triple extra large. Let's see, here's the double X. So you can see the size difference. And I wanted to make a nice size variety to cover all sorts of ladies. Um, I didn't want to discriminate between small and medium and big size ladies. I just wanted to hook up everybody. And as our new slogan goes, bless your booty. So our goal is to try to bless as many uh, men, women, and youth booties as we can. So this is the bikini style underwear. You can fully sub the whole thing. Uh, then I got one more style for the ladies. Oh, and again, this one also features a cotton crotch, which the inside right here has a layer at the in the midsection that is an organic cotton interior. So it's, uh, it's, I had three ladies try them on and the feedback was awesome. They thought it was really comfortable. And then here is the boy shorts. This is an extra small. The boy shorts also come extra small to triple extra large. And here's a printed example. So you can see the sublimated look is real nice and smooth. And you get a full sub with very little if or no imperfections. And that was my goal in developing these. Just have it amazing sublimation printability 
and an amazing wearability. And if I was able to achieve that, then I wanted to roll out the product. And also this one features the organic cotton interior on the crotch as well. Now I'm so stoked we got these right because I had samples of underwear on my desk like crazy for weeks and weeks and weeks. All right guys, here's my current situation on my desk. As you can see, it's a big underwear mess. But after much comparing, measuring, and testing, here are the two styles I wanna go with. It's gonna be this style, um, this shape and cut, but of course the material is gonna change and it's gonna be all white for sublimation. But this will be the bikini underwear style, or cut you could say, and this will be the boy short. But this uh, crotch area is gonna get reshaped to be something like this so we could sublimate that effectively. And it's gonna come in like, I think small through 3XL sizes for ladies. And yeah, it's gonna be a good product that y'all can sublimate all over and enjoy. And bless yo booty, let's get it. Uh, because I like to keep samples that if I'm developing a new product on my desk until it's final and approved. Uh, so yeah, the, the men's underwear boxers at first were on my desk spread out for weeks uh, or months, I should say. And then the ladies for months as well, just messy. Uh, finally, it feels really good to get these approved. We got about 115,000 units on the way uh, coming to us during fall of 2020. So gearing up for holiday season, fall 20, uh, I mean Christmas 2020 season boxers, underwears, you can get them at silkysocks.com in the blank section. And um, so yeah, if uh, they're not available today, by the time we make this video and publish it, they should be available or on the way in just uh, just weeks out. We're expecting them, expecting to have um, the full product line available in the fall. Uh, so probably October 2020 range. And Right now, you might be wondering where, what's this background? So, let me give you a little tour. This is the Silky Socks backup warehouse, our second warehouse. Uh, we had to get this spot for holiday season to prepare for, for the next six months or so of madness from um, you know October, November, December, January, February, etc. but especially this Q4 holiday month because my main warehouse and office is now full. The, the, we just keep getting shipments of blank uh, socks, face masks, gaiters, and now boxers, so I'm making room. And uh, let me give you a little tour. So basically we filled up some product on this side. Uh, on this side we still have room here. This will probably be all full of socks and underwears real soon as we get shipments in to stock up for the holiday season. I've also got this Mercedes-Benz Sprinter van parked here. This is our all new silky Mobis mobile office vehicle. Had to bless myself with a little something nice to celebrate uh, the success of the company and this channel and everything we got going on in 2021. The silky mobile office, you might see me rolling in that. Uh, other than that, we've got racks of product here and here. Um, just batches of product stacked because uh, like I said, that other warehouse is pretty much full. So I wanted, um, or at least getting there. So I wanted some breathability and some extra room. So we're literally just using this for storage space. Plus uh, it's a nice quiet space where I could film some of YouTube videos. So I might be doing that. Uh, and then check out what I did with the office. Just a chill little lounge area, couch, table, uh, a little nap pod there, microwave, refrigerator, and check this out, the 20K for reaching the 20K subs on YouTube. Yup, 20K baby. We are excited. Come over here, you get another 20K little decor with a little room with just two bean bags. Just hang out, my creative space again, kind of that techie vibe, think of new ideas, new content, new innovations. Ordered myself a couple little basketball hoops to put up here and here so we can shoot some hoops while we chill. And yeah, just basically 
like I said, a little cool little creative area to shoot videos and of course store our products and make it happen. All right guys, hope you liked the video. I know you wanna see me print and sub on some of these, but my next video is going to be how to sublimate the boxers and probably the ladies underwear. So stay tuned for that, but I don't have a heat press in this office, so I gotta go back to the main office to do that, which I will real soon, and you'll see that in my next video. Until then, bless your feet, bless your face, and bless your booty with some of these awesome undies. Let's get it. All right, guys, see you next time.